All right, go ahead and raise your hands and Rod will get you the mic. Hey, Charlie, when you see Alejandro Kirk right now compared to the start of the year, what is better? Well, his approach has been good the whole time. He just wasn't, wasn't getting hit. And of course, he was pressing a little bit just like everybody else because we were not hitting as, a, as an offense. But his approach was good the whole time because he was walking and even getting infield hits and everything else. And now that our offense is doing better, he's just nice and relaxed again and doing what he does. You know, that's impressive for his age to be that good, hitting whatever he's been hitting now the last two weeks and not striking out. He puts the ball in play. It's, it doesn't surprise me because, you know, I've already seen him. You've seen him. So he's doing it again. And when you have him, uh, Teoscar, hitting better today, Lourdes in there with a couple of good at-bats, how do they impact one another? When... It's huge. Uh, I, I don't know if you guys remember me saying that, yeah, we're playing good baseball, and, but it's going to be tough to sweep people if you, we don't start swinging the bats. And we're swinging the bats now. You know, we did in the road trip, and, and we, we scored six more runs today, and, 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 and we, we're pitching, and we're playing, catching the ball. So talking about catching the ball, those plays at the end were – pretty good you know uh, the ball is playing the hole uh, of course at the third base then you got to think real quick what you're going to do uh, he thought real quick what he did he threw the second base and and that was an easy pick by Espy, and, and that was a great pick so that was a big part in the eighth inning for sure charlie that's still sweating uh, Charlie, that play in the sixth on the double play to end the inning there uh, that Gurriel threw, made the throw to second. For how deflating is that for the other team when you know you have a play where you think that uh, you got you've got the tying run, but a timing play doesn't work and you get double play. So in. yeah, so that deflates the team and gets the other team going and cha keeps the momentum on our side, you know. And and but honestly, I've seen that many times at any level, even the big leagues. That that. That happens a lot. It's more than you think, you know. And 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 again, let's give credit to Guriello making that throw because that wasn't an easy throw. And actually, the guy running from first is pretty fast. So uh, that was a big throw by by Guriel. Another big play for us to stay in the game. Hey, Charlie, um, obviously Merriweather's been kind of up and down this season. What allows you to trust him in that big spot? Well, well the moment Richard struggle, now everything changes because now Simber's got to come in. And then Garcia's got to face the top of the lineup. So now Merriweather got into the game. That's, that's how it worked out. And of course, Romano was the last one. Uh, you know, if you map it out, it was going to be uh, Richard, Simber, Garcia, and Romano. But then when the moment Richard struggles, now that takes somebody out. And that's how Merriweather got to do that, pitching that inning. And he did the job at the end of the day. Are you kind of hoping to build his confidence? Because yes. the stuff is obvious. Yes, that. yes, for sure. Yeah, and he, he was throwing more fastball and sliders today, which he was good. And then, of course, the last two guys uh, got big sets. But, yeah, if he does what you've seen he done in the past, that'll be great for us, for sure. Was Phelps unavailable? Yeah, he was not. Charlie, una pregunta, ¿cómo te sientes con el bateo del equipo en momentos oportunos? Sí, lo bueno que yo siempre dije es que es difícil ganarle eh, barrer a la gente cuando tú no estás batiendo mucho y la defensa y el piché han estado ahí. Pero ahora que estamos batiendo es más fácil ganar a la gente y eso es lo que estamos haciendo ahora. El, el road trip fue tremendo y ahora hoy anotamos seis más cajeras, que eso es bien importante. Muchas gracias. Right. Translate that. Thanks, everybody.